Unlike thousands of other homeless people in Madagascar who struggle to feed themselves and make ends meet, the Rava Romanana family has found an ingenuous way to put food on the table by making soap at the Andalanatra waste dump in the capital of Antananarivo. At this public dump site, which receives more than 450 tonnes of waste daily, it's not unusual to find scores of homeless people rummaging through piles of rubbish to find something to eat. According to official statistics, there are more than 800 families who come to Adnalitra waste site and live off what they find here. In some cases, they also resell what they collect to make some money. The Rava Mamanana family of 15 has been coming to this site since 1966 to collect waste material used to make soap. After sourcing the material, which ranges from plastic to metal waste, they boil some plants that will serve as acid in the soap making process. Once all the ingredients are gathered, they are boiled in a large pot. Some oil is then added into the mixture. In order to make soap, we put the plants that you see over there and we then burn them. And once we burn them and the ashes have cooled down, we put them in a pot and add water and leave the ashes for a bit. We then collect this liquid, which looks like coffee. We then cook the oil with this liquid and mix them together. Iloa Rama is a soap vendor who has also been bitten by the entrepreneur buck and says that the soap making business allows him to feed his large family. This is the liquid that we need. This will replace the liquid that we will mix with the oil and this is what we will use to cook the oil. It's like cooking rice. Once the mixture is ready, it's left to cool and becomes a paste. The soap makers then start moulding the paste into soap cakes, which are then sold in local markets. On a good day, the soap makers sell around 50 units of soap for one US dollar. These locally made soaps are popular in Madagascar because of their low price and cosmetic qualities. Malagasy and foreigners buy the soap. Some people send them to their friends in Comoros, as well as France, for those who have families who live there. But they usually like buying the rectangular ones. The soap is good in getting rid of dandruff. It's also good for dry skin, as well as washing your face. It can be used for many things, but it's also good for removing dark marks. From next year, these families will no longer be allowed to manufacture the soaps from waste material collected at the dump site, as the government plans to build a recycling plant at the site to address health and environmental concerns.